Secondly, we must thank the bishop for the vision that he has. Because it is that vision that transforms societies and transforms cities. Where people see a dry and derelict land, you see opportunities. And you see God's presence in this community of Uruguay. Thank you for that vision. And I just want to add, because we have a vision for the city. And our vision, and every opportunity we get, we speak about that vision. That vision grows from Jeremiah 33. Jeremiah 33, 9. And anywhere you see Jerusalem, we say Nairobi. That this city shall be to me a name of joy. Nairobi shall be to him a name of joy. Praise and an honor before all nations. Asante sana kwa kusimama na kanisa. We ulitufunza na ile njia ulipitia na sisi tulijua ya kwamba kama ingekuwa ni binadamu wa amwe. Ati nani atakuwa rais? Your Excellency atuge kwa hapa. Ile mitego ulikuwa umekewa. Hata mimi ile niliwekewa. Maka kuambiwa nimefika class 2. Maka kuambiwa ati oh, sakaja haezi kuwa governor na hata kuwa governor. We just used to say it is not by power, not by might, but by the spirit of the Lord. And that is why we are here. And your excellency, we must always remember that despite all those odds, the God who brought us here didn't bring us here just for us to get here. His grace is sufficient to take us through the five years, the ten years, and the next government, Your Excellency. Because he has not retired. He has not gone on a break. He has not changed his mind. He had not made a mistake. He, will, he deliberately chose the leadership that we have, Your Excellency. So let us keep praying.